no question that I wanted to have somebody who was extremely positive. It's a great day to be a Jayhawk. Uh, very competitive, who has passion for the game of football. enjoy what you're doing. For somebody who has passion for build relationships. people. I'm also going to teach them how to visualize excellence. After an upset against Georgia Tech last week, the Jayhawks prepared to travel south to Hattiesburg for the first road game of the season. Boasting a nine-game winning streak at home, Southern Mississippi hopes to carry their momentum into a nationally televised game on Friday. With only six days of preparation, the theme of the week is urgency. Uh, then it's about our opponent, Southern Miss. Uh, we got to have more big plays than they do. They are a big play team from their offensive standpoint. They will throw the ball down the field quite a bit. And uh, we cannot allow them to have big plays in the passing game. Uh, they do some uh, pretty good things also in the running game with the quarterback. And also they have some good running backs there too. But I think the keys to the game, uh, we have to make sure that we play with a tenacity uh, that we play with comparable to just this past week's game. Uh, our guys got to uh, play with uh, the same type of execution, same passion same confidence uh, that we played this last week. Facing a team known for creating big plays, the Jayhawk defense must out-hit their opponent. It begins on practice field. Short week like this, you gotta be able to be able to refocus. Forget about last week, cause last week's gone. It's history. It was a good win, but now we focused on something miss. It's a hostile environment. Gotta go down there and get a win. It's us against the world. Thursday morning is set aside for travel as the team boards his private plane into Kansas. Only 53 players make the travel squad. Those selected understand this is not a vacation. This is a business trip. For the game, just in here, just relaxing. Pretty much got a mind on Southern Miss and just going over the, what they do in my head. And me and him talk about what's gonna happen to, in the next day to go over plays in our head, stuff like that. The quiz help you out a lot, though. You just go over the quiz right before you go to sleep. You can think about it while you're sleeping or whatever, and you wake up, you should be ready to go. It's game time after that. Game time. Go for it. You know, again, I, uh, I really hope our guys. Uh, you know, I thought the word tenacity should fit to what we have to play and how we have to play in a, in a, in a tenacious way. I mean, really, not don't necessarily need to do any any more energy than what they had in this previous ball game. Obviously, there might be a few little execution-wise things to clean up from that standpoint. But if they play with the same energy and play the same confidence uh, that we played in this last ball game and clean up a couple of things here, uh, I really think that uh, we'll be in good shape. You know, playing with that confidence.
Fans flood the streets as they await the arrival of their team. They make their way to the stadium to welcome the players. While the Eagles locker room feels like home, to the Jayhawks, it feels like a road game. Stage is set. Thousands sit glued to the TV as the Jayhawks take the field against a hostile crowd. In any fight, it's the first punch that sets the tone. On Friday, Southern Miss came in swing. The quarterback, Austin, gonna throw a little screen pass over here to Brown. Look out, he's up to the 30, ripped down at the 33. Who's got some running room, down to the 40, and inside the KU 40. Power formation, they go to Floyd again, he throws a pass. It is caught in the end zone for a touchdown. Stunned in the first half, and the Jayhawks refused to remain quiet. The second round belonged to them. And they played a Sims running right to the 45 50, 45, and tripped up. Boy, had a full head of steam. Jayhawks at the 28 of Southern Miss. Webb's in trouble, now scrambling, running wide right, 20, down to the 15, a first down. Boy, what a zigzag run there by Jordan Webb. He got a first down. There's the snap, and they run a draw play to open. Sands. Open, into the end zone, touchdown. Looking, throwing, up the field of Beery. No flag, he caught it anyway. Ball thrown and picked off. Strozier. Valentine threw it down the field, and Philip Strozier picks it off. Here's the snap and the kick on the way, and it Looks is good. good. He got it. Back to throw it is Webb, pumping to the far side to Jonathan Wilson. He's got He's it. He's got it, in for the touchdown. A 
different team in the second half. The Jayhawks fought back wild. But in the end, it wasn't enough. This was a barometer game for both of these teams. As Kansas is going to go back and uh, try to go back to where they were last week with a 1 and 2 record. Guys, play, play hard. You just got to tip your hat off to them. They did a good job. We got to come back ready to work. Come back ready to, uh, ready to work from a standpoint of execution. We got to be a little bit more detailed in practice and fine-tuning things here to be ready to play in the game. And we'll get better. We will get better. I hope it hurts. I hope it hurts. If it doesn't hurt, then something's wrong with you. So come back here ready to go tomorrow. I think we got, uh, I think it's 4 o'clock, our team meeting. New coach, new team, new dream. We put it all together and we just gon' believe. Visualize excellence, winning everything. Practice make perfect, so perfect will be. New coach, new team. We put it all together and we just gon' believe. Visualize excellence, winning everything. Practice make perfect, so perfect will be.